New here at three, while social distancing continues, neighbors who would normally be having barbecues and block parties together are trying to find other ways to have fun while staying safe. Here's ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd. Well, the homes on Butterfly Kiss Drive have only been around for a few years, yet the people who live here say they feel like they've been lifelong friends, and you can see that camaraderie through this music video. You can't touch this. We found out there are a lot of good dancers on the street. You can't touch this. It's a great chance to have a party with our neighbors. My, 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 my. I'm glad I live next to a whole bunch of people just as weird as me. Carrie Ziegler is the woman behind this music video. She said it's been sad for her family not being able to plan large gatherings with their neighbors. It was kind of hard for us. We usually, um, during the summer, have a block party, um, and we are always kind of at each other's houses. So Carrie came up with a way to unify the block, a video where everyone can dance together at a safe distance in their own driveways. I thought this is the perfect thing for our neighborhood to do because we're all very tight-knit. 13 households ended up participating while a golf cart rolled down the street capturing a variety of choreography. NASA Smith's driveway consisted of four generations. Everyone was involved. That's what I loved about it. The video quickly received thousands of hits on the neighborhood Facebook page. People were stopping me to tell me how much they enjoyed it. Nicole Salter remembers dancing to the MC Hammer song back in junior high, but she said this time around, it was a lot more meaningful. Although everyone was distant in social distancing, we were all still together. In Atlanta Lakes, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.